Good morning and welcome to Turn Point 7 Titlis, where we're at an altitude of 3,000 meters. So today is a very, very special day. It's Tom de Dorlado's birthday. Yay. He's 34, so go over to Tom's page, send him some love. He is 34 today, special day. So sending you uh, lots of love, Tom. You're having a great race. And uh, my colleague Ed just spoke to him and did a little interview uh, about his race. And he's having a blinder. He's done, this is his seventh time in the Red Bull X Alps. Uh, he's having one of his best races. He said it's just, it's just proving to be really a great adventure. And he's kind of explaining why, it, you know, what makes it such a great adventure. Uh, you know, the fact that you're kind of flying with other people, hiking and the, the camaraderie. Uh, you make friends for life. So have a look online to that story. Other stories today, well, of course, there's a battle up at the front. Uh, Kriegel took off last night and he's now somewhere near uh, the Eiger. He's looking like he'll, he'll tag that pretty shortly. It's only 38 kilometers away from here. Um, but elsewhere, the Chaser Pack uh, is really interesting what's going on over there. Um, Maxime is, I'll just turn around. Maxime, he's on the other side uh, of the valley. What he's trying to do is get up high and obviously fly across. Athletes will do anything to avoid hiking up here because it will take uh, a very long time. It's a game changing uh, point in the race. It's brutal, 10 kilometers distance and close to 2000 meters of vertical. So that can take half a day uh, uh, out, of your, out of your schedule. So uh, watch Maxime and then uh, following behind him, we've got Paul Gushelbauer, funnily enough, in third place, what is it about third place and Paul Gushelbauer? Three of his four Red Bull X Alps out, uh, uh, outings have, have finished with a, a third uh, place finish. Uh, that was in 2000, uh, 2011 in his first year as a rookie. Uh, 2013, he finished ninth, but then again in, in, in uh, 15 and 17, he was third again. So uh, maybe, maybe it agrees with him. Uh, Aaron Duragati doing so well. The French athletes as well coming on behind. Uh, there's, there's quite a gaggle all at uh, Davos at the moment. So stay tuned uh, to live tracking. I know that uh, many places around the Alps, it's a public holiday today. So even though you're not at work, you can still follow the race. Uh, it, live tracking works perfectly on a mobile, including uh, VR. So if you want that cockpit view on a phone, it'll still work. It's working uh, really well today, so uh, as it has done all race. So tune into live tracking, follow the race, send Tom's, send Tom's loads of love, and we look forward to seeing you later on. Thanks for watching.